The First Book of the Chronicles, Chapter 1 Adam, Seth, Enosh, Kenan, Mahalalel, Jared, Enoch, Methuselah, Lamech, Noah, Shem, Ham, and Japheth. The sons of Japheth were Gomer, Magog, Madai, Javon, Tubal, Meshech, and Tiras. The sons of Gomer were Ashkenaz, Dipheth, and Togama. The sons of Javon were Elisha, Tarshish, Kittim, and Rodanim. The sons of Ham were Cush, Mizraim, Phut, and Canaan. The sons of Cush were Seba, Havilah, Sabta, Reama, and Sabtika. And the sons of Reama were Sheba and Dedan. Cush became the father of Nimrod. He began to be a mighty one in the earth. Mizraim became the father of the people of Lud, Enam, Lehab, Naphtu, Pathrus, Kaslu, from which the Philistines came, and Kaphtor. Canaan became the father of Sidon, his firstborn, Heth, and the Jebusites, the Amorites, the Girgashites, the Hivites, the Archites, the Sinites, the Arvadites, the Zemarites, and the Hamathites. The sons of Shem were Elam, Ashur, Arpachshad, Lud, Aram, Uz, Hul, Gether, and Meshech. Arpachshad became the father of Shelah, and Shelah became the father of Eber. Two sons were born to Eber. The name of the one was Peleg, for in his days the earth was divided, and his brother's name was Joktan. Joktan became the father of Almadad, Shelef, Hazarmaveth, Jira, Hadoram, Uzal, Dikla, Ebal, Abimeel, Sheba, Ophir, Havilah, and Jobab. All these were the sons of Joktan. Shem, Arpachshad, Shela, Eber, Peleg, Reu, Sirug, Nahor, Tira, Abram, that is Abraham. The sons of Abraham were Isaac and Ishmael. These are their genealogies. The firstborn of Ishmael was Nebaoth, then Kedar, Abil, Mibsam, Mishma, Duma, Masa, Hadad, Tima, Jeter, Nephish, and Kidema. These were the sons of Ishmael. The sons of Keturah, Abraham's concubine, whom she bore, were Zimran, Jokshan, Midan, Midian, Ishbak, and Shua. And the sons of Jokshan were Sheba and Dedan. The sons of Midian were Ephah, Epher, Hanuk, Abida, and Eldea. All these were the sons of Keturah. Abraham became the father of Isaac. The sons of Isaac were Esau and Israel. The sons of Esau were Eliphaz, Reuel, Jeush, Jalam, and Korah. The sons of Eliphaz were Timon, Omar, Zephi, Gatam, Kenaz, Timnah, and Amalek. The sons of Reuel were Nehath, Zira, Shama, and Misa. The sons of Seir were Lotan, Shobal, Zibion, Ena, Daishon, Ezer, and Daishan. The sons of Lotan were Horai and Homam, and Lotan's sister was Timnah. The sons of Shobal were Alayan, Manahath, Ebal, Shephai, and Onam. And the sons of Zibion were Ea and Anna. The sons of Anna were Daishon, and the sons of Daishon were Hamran, Eshban, Ithran, and Kiran. The sons of Ezer were Bilhan, Zeavan, and Jaktan. The sons of Daishon were Uz and Aran. Now these are the kings who reigned in the land of Edom before any king of the sons of Israel reigned, Bela was the son of Beor, and the name of his city was Dinhaba. When Bela died, Jobab the son of Zerah of Bozrah became king in his place. When Jobab died, Husham of the land of the Temanites became king in his place. When Husham died, Hadad the son of Bedad, who defeated Midian in the field of Moab, became king in his place, and the name of his city was Avith. When Hadad died, Samla of Masrekah became king in his place. When Samla died, Shaul of Rehoboth by the river became king in his place. When Shaul died, Baal Hinan, the son of Akbor, became king in his place. When Baal Hinan died, Hadad became king in his place, and the name of his city was Pai. And his wife's name was Mehetabel, the daughter of Matred, the daughter of Mezahab. Then Hadad died. Now the chiefs of Edom were Chief Timnah, Chief Aliah, Chief Jetheth, Chief Oholabama, Chief Elah, Chief Pinon, Chief Kenaz, Chief Timon, Chief Mibzar, Chief Magdiel, Chief Iram. 
These were the chiefs of Edom. Chapter 2 These are the sons of Israel, Reuben, Simeon, Levi, Judah, Issachar, Zebulun, Dan, Joseph, Benjamin, Naphtali, Gad, and Asher. The sons of Judah were Er, Onan, and Shelah. These three were born to him by Bathshua the Canaanitess. And Er, Judah's firstborn, was wicked in the sight of the Lord, so he put him to death. Tamar his daughter-in-law bore him Perez and Zerah. Judah had five sons in all. The sons of Perez were Hezron and Hamul. The sons of Zerah were Zimri, Ethan, Iman, Kalkol, and Dara, five of them in all. The son of Carmi was Akar, the troubler of Israel, who violated the ban. The son of Ethan was Azariah. Now the sons of Hezron who were born to him were Jeramiel, Ram, and Chelubai. Ram became the father of Aminadab, and Aminadab became the father of Nashon, leader of the sons of Judah. Nashon became the father of Salma, Salma became the father of Boaz, Boaz became the father of Obed, and Obed became the father of Jesse. And Jesse became the father of Eliab, his firstborn, then Abinadab the second, Shimei the third, Nathanael the fourth, Radai the fifth, Ozem the sixth, David the seventh. And their sisters were Zeruiah and Abigail. And the three sons of Zeruiah were Abishai, Joab, and Asahel. Abigail bore Amasa, the father of Amasa, was Jether the Ishmaelite. Now Caleb, the son of Hezron, had sons by Azubah his wife, and by Jerioth. And these were her sons, Jeshur, Shobab, and Arden. When Azubah died, Caleb married Ephrath, who bore him Hur. Hur became the father of Uri, and Uri became the father of Bezalel. Afterward Hezron went in to the daughter of Machir, the father of Gilead, whom he married when he was sixty years old, and she bore him Segub. Segub became the father of Jair, who had twenty-three cities in the land of Gilead. But Geshur and Aram took the towns of Jair from them, with Kenoth and its villages, even sixty cities. All these were the sons of Machir, the father of Gilead. After the death of Hezron in Caleb Ephrathah, Abijah, Hezron's wife, wore him Ashur, the father of Tekoah. Now the sons of Jaramiel, the firstborn of Hezron, were Ram, the firstborn, then Buna, Oren, Ozem, and Ahijah. Jaramiel had another wife whose name was Atara. She was the mother of Onam. The sons of Ram, the firstborn of Jeremiel, were Meaz, Jamin, and Iker. The sons of Onam were Shammai and Jada. And the sons of Shammai were Nadab and Abishur. The name of Abishur's wife was Abihail, and she bore him Aban and Molid. The sons of Nadab were Seled and Apaim, and Seled died without sons. The son of Apaim was Ishai, and the son of Ishai was Sheshan, and the son of Sheshan was Alai. The sons of Jada, the brother of Shammai, were Jether and Jonathan, and Jether died without sons. The sons of Jonathan were Peleth and Zaza. These were the sons of Jeremiel. Now Shishan had no sons, only daughters, and Shishan had an Egyptian servant whose name was Jarha. Shishan gave his daughter to Jarha his servant in marriage, and she bore him Atai. Atai became the father of Nathan, and Nathan became the father of Zebad. And Zebad became the father of Ephlal, and Ephlal became the father of Obed, and Obed became the father of Jehu, and Jehu became the father of Azariah, and Azariah became the father of Helez, and Helez became the father of Eliasa, and Eliasa became the father of Sismai, and Sismai became the father of Shalom, and Shalom became the father of Jechamiah, and Jechamiah became the father of Elishama. Now the sons of Caleb, the brother of Jeremiel, were Misha, his firstborn, who was the father of Ziph, and his son was Marasha, the father of Hebron. The sons of Hebron were Korah, and Tapua, and Rechem, and Shema. Shema became the father of Reham, the father of Jorakam, and Rechem became the father of Shammai. The son of Shammai was Maon, and Maon was the father of Bezur. Ephah, Caleb's concubine, bore Haran, Moza, and Gazez, and Haran became the father of Gazez. The sons of Jadai were Regem, Jotham, Gishan, Pilet, Ephah, and Sheaf.
Meaka, Caleb's concubine, bore Sheber and Tirhana. She also bore Sheaf, the father of Madmana, Sheva, the father of Machbina, and the father of Gibeah, and the daughter of Caleb was Aksa. These were the sons of Caleb. The sons of Hur, the firstborn of Ephratha, were Shobal, the father of Kiriath Jearim, Salma, the father of Bethlehem, and Haref, the father of Beth Gader. Shobal, the father of Kiriath Jearim, had sons, Haroe, half of the Manahathites, and the families of Kiriath Jearim, the Ithrites, the Puthites, the Shumathites, and the Mishrites. From these came the Zorathites and the Estuolites. The sons of Salma were Bethlehem, and the Netophathites, Atroth Beth Joab, and half of the Manahathites, the Zorites. The families of scribes who lived at Jabez were the Tirhites, the Shimeathites, and the Sukathites. These are the Kenites who came from Hamath, the father of the house of Rechab.